Hey guys, I'm Uncle Bernard and welcome to Turmoil. Uh, this is part of my random game Wednesday series or whatever the heck I'm going to call it. I still haven't decided on a name yet. Uh, and basically this game will be becoming the biggest oil tycoon company thing in the wild west. Yeah. This is, um, this is early access, as I always do, I'll leave links in the description to if you want to have a check it out. I think it's £3, uh, something around that price. It's really, it's really cheap, so I pick it up. I played a bit of the game, although not a whole lot. Let me just check if settings are alright. Full screen, yep, yeah, right, we're all good on that. Okay. Um, there is a campaign to this. Um, I'm a little bit unsure as to whether to do the campaign or to do the single game. I'll do, I'll continue the campaign. So I've done a bit of this. Um, the start of it was like teaching you how to like, um, like how to mine and stuff like that. I can show you that anyway. So, howdy, my name is Fred Metal. Are you looking to make your oil mining operation more efficient? Come to my factory to upgrade your gear. Gears and bolts, like that name. How much money have I got? Who, are, who am I? I forgot who I am. I think I'm Joshua. Uh, Wit. Uh, size, uh, branch two, timer two. I think I need more time to suddenly be a good upgrade. Oh, I can't even get it. I'll increase my width. Because being able to get more oil is what. Yeah, I am Joshua. Being able to get more oil is what I need. A bit more oil is all I need. Where do you want to go? Your first piece of land for your town hall. So this is basically where you can, um, it gives you a zone that you have to try and mine, and the more you play, I'm guessing the more you can get more land. Well, oh, search, I'm ready to start bidding. No. Pick a parcel of land, the numbers are mined past to indicate how much oil they have, or had. So that one's the one we're aiming for. Oh, I can't get that one. I take it the bigger the land, hopefully the more oil it has, but then again, that's just... Wow, you've gone really far out. Okay, so I've got a bit of land, so now we have to start digging. Let's go get that oil. We're taking two ground with us to cover the startup cost, so we're ready to go. So I've upgraded, plus I've got minus two, so. Uh, what we have to start, oh. From now on, levels will run from January to June the 30th. Right, so we've got until June the 30th to start mining. So what we need to do for, oh. Looking for another place to sell your oil? Come to me, at my place, the first is always right. So you have left ink and right ink and what they do is you can see the numbers at the top uh, that basically tells you how much they're charging for oil so they're charging 74 pence and they're one dollar 48 pence so right ink is where we need to go for now but the, pr the price fluctuates between obviously which company so you have to start to be you have to be mindful as to where the price goes this uh the little arrow in the number those are how many carts you send to this place so I, i'm sending nothing because i've got no carts but I can, sh I can show you that, so. Um, what I do is I have to send a dowser first to find the oil. They just have a little stick and just walk along. So two is normally what you start off with, but the more money you have, the more uh, you spend. So right now, let's get a rig ready. So whoever finds oil first. Uh, putting the sallow in the middle, uh, the sallow here, uh, that uh, basically keeps all your oil in the silo. Uh, and then what you do is you then put the numbers up and they'll, oh, so they found some. Then, this is the hard bit, you have to try and guess where the oil is, because you don't know, so... By halfway is usually the best bet. And you've also got some as well. So upgrade the pad, I just click on it, thank you. So I just made it in, so we're lucky there. Right, so now we need... A wagon to start taking the oil. I'll have two. I'll have a salad here. If you're low on cash, aren't we all sometimes? Uh, you can take out a loan against a very reasonable interest rate. Pfft. Click on the cash counter on the top of the finance window. I'm fine. Right, so I think right now. Take it to writing while we've still got a bit of money to make on it. 
because we need just a bit of extra money just to cover ourselves in case anything happens. Uh, in the campaign, usually getting to around a thousand is um, round about where you need to be in order to win. Because whoever has the most money at the end wins. Right, so left ink is the place to go. So start taking your uh, oil there. Usually keeping it in the cell is a good idea, just in case, like right at the end, you want to uh, make sure that you've got enough left over. Oh, my nose is running. So my hair fever is playing up. That's why I'm like constantly going at my nose because my my hair fever is going at it. So this is this is just what the game is. It is still in early access, I think. So just give it a bit of a a bit of a. <laughs> uh, relax on it because obviously early access games are really good usually like you can see how writing has gone to like 30 pence while well, left ink really going up so yeah so I do think actually 2000 is probably where we're going to have to end up in order to win this I was going to release um, Slime Rancher today but it didn't record properly there's no audio but I've, I fixed that issue now so I should be fine then again, this game you can just like, play for ages and it won't matter. Right, we do need a few more cards because we are starting to reach our uh, max capacity. I think I don't know what happened when we reach max capacity on oil uh, in this in the um, in the in the what's it called a rig. I think it just like starts overflowing. Right, the price is still good, so hurry up and start taking it there. God, writing's really gone down in price. Uh, these do empty, by the way, the um, in this. So I have to start looking for more as well. Hence why I need a lot of money. So now I'm in the two grands. Right, I think our best bet now is to start storing it in the silo. Because writing starting to come up. So we'll wait for writing. Although I'm going to start running out of room for my silo. Um, right, so I'll take it to writing. Yeah, so I'll take some money. So I'll take some oil out of the salad and start taking it over to writing. Yeah, that's why having two rigs in the silo at the start is crucial because when you start getting more of um, these wagons, having oil in the silo is actually crucial. Because as you can see, they're really low, so they won't go for them usually. They usually, head straight to the silo to get some oil. I haven't won this already, I don't even need to uh, really get any more oil from the ground because honestly I think we've got enough to last us until June. I love the music in this, I like this, oh, right that's time to run out of oil so. Uh, this one's still running, so if I upgrade, right now, we need to start looking for that. so that's out of all. Come on, find something. That's saying it's full. Ah, oh, in a spillage. It's really oil. Fix it by buying new wagons or by reducing the number of wagons selling oil. Spare one, right. So I've reduced the number selling oil and they're going to collect it. Come on, hit it. Yes, we've hit it. I love how they disappear, it's like, ooh, I've gone. Uh, so we've got about another month before we, uh... oh, left ink. Uh... Yeah, you start taking it there. We'll equal it out. Because right ink has still got good prices. Usually, when it gets around the 70s, um, you stop selling there and go to the next company if it's higher. Oh, that's my idea. I could probably stop grading this because this one's out, so.
That one's out as well. Uh, right. Let's get another dowser. I need to start looking for more oil. I hate having to guess. Damn it now. Right, come on, come on. Hit it, hit it. Don't go through. Damn it, I went through. Right, stop pumping the oil. Yeah, we've reached the end. Oh, if I went down a bit further, I would have hit that one. Ah. Oh. Our spillage fine was £747.12, well, $7.12. That was a summary, so do we win? Yes! Oh, we thrashed everyone. We beat them really badly. Wow. Right. I love this game, so I don't know what they're building here. Now to meet you. I dare would. I'm a bit of a handyman. I like to spend with stuff that can help you find oil. Make sure to check out my inventions. Depth to speed to mold scanner. I can't afford the scanner. I think right now we just need to keep digging for oil. Upgrading oh, with Oh, we need to. Yeah, so this one is. Oh, I can't even go for it. Anyway, that's what in mind I can't go for. Those are the tutorial areas. This is the actual play. So this area is definitely the area that's got the most oil in it, so if we go for this one. Yeah, we all have the same idea, stay in this area, because it's got the most oil in it. I was going to go for this one, but it's near the water, so I don't know how fast it's going to be. Oh yeah! <laughs> here, we're, here where oil is. Right, here we go. Oh, my nose. So, I've still got 12 grand to spend. So, if I... Same again. Again, writing is where to go at the start. You need to be quick off the mark. Come on, I'll be in the same area. That makes it harder. Got one. Come on, lads, hurry up. You found one yet? Hurry up. Yes. that far. Yeah, didn't think it'd be that far. Right, so that's the thing of rat ink. Really quick. Buy a silo. Oh god, we're really close to a uh, profit margin. Right. So right ink is going down really quick. The left ink starts to go up, so. Uh, oh, oh. Split between. Split between. Hopefully that guy will go to that one and this guy will go to this one. Right, yeah, right ink's definitely not more profitable anymore. I, I really like these types of games, these uh, like little micromanagement games, because it really feels like I'm getting really invested, like I'm an actual oil tycoon. I've got a profit on all that oil in the wild west. I always love like uh, like history. I like um, more olden times because I've seen uh, pictures of what my place where I used to live was actually like back in like 
the 1900s, probably even a bit further back than that. And honestly, I just love to look at it. Like it was like really old fashioned. We were all. It was, it was amazing. I would love to live in those types of times. Apart from like the medicine. The medicine wouldn't have been as good as what it is today. Although they are saying that antibiotics are starting to become uh, completely useless now. Because our bot things have become resistant to it. This is really frightening considering that we won't have antibiotics to like treat infections and stuff like that. That is frightening. I hate that like that because I've, I've been in hospital quite a lot and I, and I know people have been in and out of hospital all the time and you now that's really really scary to think that you know in a couple of years we may not have antibiotics may be completely useless so all that time looking and sit, relying on them has completely been a waste of time and it has lasted us a really long time though but it should have been obvious that at some point antibiotics would become Useless so because what bacteria do, they become, they adapt like we do. We adapt, but they adapt as well. So it's, it's scary. Anyway, I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm talking about antibiotics now. Went from oil to antibiotics. Who'd have thought of that? Right. So now, left ink become unprofitable. So let's go to right ink. I need more oil because I've got way too many. Uh, Douse can go there, can go there. Bow, bow, bow. Bow, 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 bow. <laughs> have it, have a, a, a rig right in front of left ink. Wow, I actually think you did it. I can't go there. Yes, I know we stop waving at me. I'm looking. Anything? Ah, I've missed it by mere inches. Right, so right ink's starting to go down, left ink's still not gone up, so. Right, so stop selling up writing. Stop putting it into the silo. Because left ink will start going up pretty quick. It usually does right around when it gets into the 50s, it starts going up really quickly. And we need to because the silo is starting to fill up. Come on, left ink. Well, right ink's starting to go up a bit again now. Maybe it's worth investing back in there. Yeah, left ink's starting to go up pretty quick again, so. It's not as profitable as, as right. I think that one's going to start to get empty pretty soon. Judging by I can't really see the oil anymore. But we should be fine with this one. This one's still got plenty of oil in it. Come on, we're in a dollar per gallon. Come on. We're in our last month now. I love the music in this game. It's amazing. Yeah. Come on, that one's going to start to fill up now. Let's, come on, let's earn six grand. That won us. That one got us by far last time. Come on. Yes, yes, yes. Oh. Come on, go for that one. Fine now. I, I was a bit panicking then. I was like, we're going to start getting the spillage because it took us quite a bit of money off us. And yeah, we can start earning about seven grand here.
No, we're not. Yeah, look, look what we struck there. So we got about seven grand there. We should have won by that. Yeah, although it's designed to equal us now. So I've got now got a barn. Hello there, I'm Rainer, the trainer. I take care of the horses to keep them healthy and ready for work. Drop on my stables and we'll be able to help each other. Oh, this is what we need. So we can increase the size of the uh, carriage, which will be useful because it is... Um... Then again, we'll only be left with three grand, which ain't a lot to mess around with. But anyway, it doesn't matter. I'm going to leave this here because this is a really good game. Uh, I would highly recommend it. I'll leave a link to it in the description. If I forget, which I more than likely will because I've done it twice now, let me know and I'll put it back, I'll put it in. Because I forgot to put it in my Love is Strange one, although it was in the first video. It was in the first video because that's where I got it from. So anyway, thank you for watching. If you're new to the channel, please subscribe for the channel, new to the channel, and I'll see you in another video. Bye guys. I don't know if I said subscribe, but subscribe anyway. <laughs>